I want to show you this story, Charlie. Yeah. Um, so this is about um, this lovely bride who was on her way to her, the wedding. And you know what, what you often do is you, you know, hire a sort of vintage car to go to the wedding, right? To get to the church on time. Except for Shanice uh, was left stranded on a country road in her wedding dress when the vintage Ford, apparently lost power, would not restart. Oh. Oh, this happened to me. This happened to me. The vintage car did not start. So my dad had to drive me to the church, squashed into a polo, a VW polo. Anyway, so it sort of <laughs> makes me... In so way, it to the occasion. Oh, no, it was brilliant. It was really funny. And thank What goodness. happened in this circumstance? This one, they rang loads of taxi companies and nobody was, but would come and pick them up. And luckily, they managed to hitch a lift by passing tourists... Matt and Michelle Moore, apparently, picked them up, uh, drove 30 minutes to the church, allowing Shanice to marry her husband, Sean, aged 28. So I had a lovely, happy ending. Surely you would stop, wouldn't you? Well, you see well, someone would in, in, in a, stop. Oh, a my wedding goodness, dress, of you know, clearly on their way to a wedding and yeah. they're stranded. You would stop, wouldn't you? Anyway, she made it, thankfully, um, which was lovely. So well done and congratulations to the happy couple. Uh, can you get really close in on this picture? Because it's never a bad time to see a, a silly picture, is it? Um, can you get right in on that? Yeah, so there we go. If you're a little bit confused as to what it is, I can explain. It's a baby and... So, yeah, baby in a pram. This is, in the, in the background there, is a stingray. This is Lake District Coast uh, Aquarium. And it just gives the impression, the picture of the baby there, it gives the impression that the, the stingray is kind of posing for the picture. It's just sort of loomed up <laughs> to get in the picture as well. It just really tickles sweet. me. It's sweet, isn't it?